what is the difference between WebRTC and HLS? Is one better than the other? The goal of each is the same, right? We're trying to deliver a compressed stream of video to a player so people can watch it. The differences between the two is a combination of design goals and, and then, of course, how they're implemented. I think the easiest way for me to explain this is to give you an analogy. Think of two ways to put out a fire, right? We have the old school way of the bucket brigade back in the day. One bucket after the other being dumped on the fire. And then we have the more modern way of doing it with fire hose. We're just spewing water at the fire until it goes out. Well, to a certain extent, the HTTP streaming formats like HLS and Dash, well, they deliver video in small chunks, one at a time. A lot like a bucket brigade to put out a fire. WebRTC takes a different approach. It delivers a continuous stream of data, much like a fire hose being used to put out a fire. And there's pluses and minuses to both approaches. With the chunk-based approach of HLS and Dash, it's pretty easy if, for whatever reason, a chunk or part of a chunk doesn't get delivered, to re-deliver that chunk and try again. With WebRTC, think about it if the fire hose isn't quite aimed at the fire. Well, that, that water's lost. It's not doing any good to put out the fire. WebRTC works a little bit like that. If the data gets dropped, it just continues on, and you, could, you can lose frames for the sake of preserving latency. And they, these are overgeneralizations to a certain extent, right? There's, there's mechanisms within WebRTC to try to recover if packets get lost and things like that. But by and large, it sacrifices some things to be low latency. So, you know, to wrap up the original question, is one better than the other, really it comes down to what you're after. For the highest quality where latency is not as much of a concern, HLS and Dash are probably going to fit that bill a little better. WebRTC is going to be optimized for the very lowest latency, and sometimes you have to sacrifice quality to do that. So both formats have their place, and it really depends on what you're trying to do. So give us a call. We'd be happy to talk you through it. We'd be happy to learn more about what you're trying to accomplish and, and propose the best way for you to get the job done.